In this issue of Real Magic, I hate it when a magician goes like that. I've been having a lot of fun with this at my strolling set, and it's been getting great reactions, so I can highly recommend this trick. Watch, that's one. Listen, that's two. And they both go across. Pretty good trick. Pretty good trick. Is there anything that you uh, learned or continue to learn from doing kid shows that you can apply to working for adult audiences, corporate gigs, that oh. sort of thing? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, this is a production item. Yes. And this is Quinn and Bottle. Right, right. This is a production item, Quinn and Bottle. And so I, I always loved it. And it was like just you taking the stuff that's around and doing it something different. Ah, cool. Uh, he has methods here for not handing out the card at the end or with a slight variation handing out the card at the end. They both look good, but frankly, I would only do the version where you hand out the card at the end. And then I started realizing, wow, you know, we're magicians and we can't keep a secret, yeah. you know? Yeah, the magicians are the worst people in the world at yeah. keeping a secret, it And seems. I thought, okay, now what's the difference? And once again, I was confirmed that, you know, it was the lack of rite of passage. Yeah. We're not keeping secrets here. We've got three tricks and three moves for you to learn, including an exclusive trick from Sean Farquhar. You've got to experience the best deal in magic today. Real Magic Magazine. Television for magicians.